That's enough, Shinny. Give her the Tonto back. <laughs> the disrespect of it all. With the katana drop or the mic drop. Hello. And welcome to We Ain't Seen It Reactions. ASMR. Today we're going to be reacting to one of your favorites. Teenage Mutant. I was like, is this ASMR or a, a reenactment of the damn sloth from uh, Zootopia or whatever the fuck that shit I was? Had to be, I had to be cool with it. And you were going so slow, though. But that's the way the ASMR videos be doing. You sound like the, the kid who has asthma from Malcolm in the Middle, that black kid. That, oh, this doesn't feel authentic. That's some good ASMR right there. <laughs> I was just trying to help the people get to sleep. But guys, it's time for more TMNT 2012 reaction. Um, last time we left off, we found ourselves in a very dark, well not even dark, but just downright weird. <laughs> it's almost like these are like the Twilight Zone versions. Yes, this is the Twilight Zone season. Oh my god. Yeah. Now mm -hmm. I'm gonna give me another one of these wigs because I look Proof crazy. Out. I look crazy. That's right. You're like you're about to solve a mystery. Jinkies. That's right. Anyway, yeah, um, we, this is the, 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 the look. This entire show is the Twilight Zone, but this season has really been some Twilight Zone esque behavior. We have had mutants of all kinds. We have had frog mutants, car mutants, Bigfoot, fucking what else? We have beavers. Beavers, dream beaver weavers. They who ain't went to sleep for the last forty years. We done had it all on this season, and I think. If I'm not mistaken, we've given almost every episode, or at least me, I know I've probably given almost every episode or every episode an S. Yeah, we had mom mutants. We've had everything, man. Every creepy thing you can imagine that could go on in Ninja Turtle World has happened. And now we're ready to jump back in for another episode, see what they over there talking about. Yeah, let's see what they over there talking about, man. So this is going to be episode seven titled Eyes of the Chimera. Damn. Let's see what kind of bullshit Every this... time I hear Chimera, all I can think of... Oh, is... don't even think it. Big Brother! Edward, don't hurt... No. I'm sorry, guys. Don't mean a... Oh, ah! oh, oh wounds. Ah! <laughs> well, let's do this. Is this Air Razor? How does time for to get into some mutagen? Oh, it's gonna eat up. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's gonna eat be a, a mix of... Who ate a worm. Who ate the mutagen. Yeah. Oh, maybe not. Oh shit, I forgot. They didn't. They, they knocked didn't. him off a cliff. What are you talking about? Oh, they did. They did. Yeah, they did. Oh, the car fell into the water and the yeah. car was the mutagen. Oh, they're going to show how the mutagen got in the water? From the car. Yeah. Because he was all like, I'll be back. That's all I'm saying. He's like showing how he got there. Oh, he didn't even fall in the water. No, let's see. Worms. Ugh. What well, it look like Super Creeper flying off the table and plug this baby in. Check you out. Is that a tiara? I love tiaras. It's not a tiara. It's a psychic neurotransmitter. Whoa. That was my second guess. Donnie salvaged it from the crane ship. He's gonna use it to test my psychic powers. Turn it on the right station, man. Put it on the Sierra. You feel anything? Ooh. Mm -hmm. Did somebody no. leave the stove on? Okay. How about now? Oh, that tingles. Mm -hmm. Okay, April. Now, focus on the card. Close your eyes and tell me what you see. I see... I see... <laughs> A bird. Ooh, so close. It flies like a... Shh. You should yeah. the test. Yeah, it's right gonna charades. I'm gonna say... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah, ah. Nigga. I'd be getting a lot of Mikey. A fish? Ooh, ooh. Ah, 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 Why is she Mikey? describing the things that got mutated? Well, stop mm -hmm. being annoying. A worm. Definitely. 
definitely a worm. Earthworm gills. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that <it. laughs> chicken over there. But these images in my head, they feel so right. Yeah, Leo. I bet you take us both down. Casey, anyway. Let's find out. Okay, maybe he's doing a little better. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? He got a little more pep know, in his step. The last time we thought he had did better and his ass was... He was weird. doing stuff that he saw in a video game. That's why. Oh, God. Here we go. As I said, Bro, sit man. your ass down. Just let me down here. It's hopeless. Oh, come on, Maybe if you'd sit down for long enough, you could heal. Out. You could still spar with us. No. I mean, I just hold All you All right, back. Mr. Grumpy Pants. You guys train. I'll watch. Uh-oh. Jean Grey. Mikey. Fuck. I didn't do that. I swear. <laughs> Look at bird. But that means, April, you are telekinetically levitating the cards. April? April, you okay? April is going to another dimension. Can you hear me? Yeah, she look like y'all when you're in your action mode. Oh, y'all swap bird. What happened to the oh. barn? Where are you? <gasps> is she blind? Uh, still in the barn? Uh, I thought she turned into the chicken at first. Is it invisible? Uh, looks pretty visible to me. I mean, y'all made my girl Ray Charles. April, where do you think you are? What do you see? Clouds. I told her she's viewing through the I eyes. I think I'm mm -hmm. flying. Totally understand. I get that way when I eat pizza. You're seeing things. Mikey gets high off of pizza confirmed. Did that help? I'm still in the air. <laughs> That is ugly. It is. That looks like that damn titty monster from damn Chainsaw. I was saying, I was thinking that same That's thing. That's exactly what it looks like. What the heck? I know this one. There's like a perfect name for it in mythology. Chimera? Yeah. No, Turducken. Turducken? <laughs> but it's not a duck, though. Uh oh. There you go. It's gonna take Leo. Fucking Game of Thrones shit right here. It will not stay down. What did you get up for? Oh, God. I better do something. Put a hook up in that motherfucker. Come on, Case. Gungala, let's get it. Oh shit. Go got got. Jeepers creepers. No! I know where it's taking them. And uh oh. I know why it took them too. It's hungry. I feel really hungry. Please don't tell me it has babies. Oh. Mikey hungry. <laughs> Oh, it has babies. It has to. I'm over. This is a show. Maybe it'll leave us alone now. Um, no. I think we're supposed to begin with. Yes, has done already went and got all those people. What are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's move! I'll tell you, time moves so fast up in this. I think these things get mutated. Boy, she can feel its pain. I, I'm fine. I, I could feel the creature's pain. Really? It got dizzy. The guys are at the top of Talbot Peak. If you can feel we the shit, try to control the damn thing. April, look at us. That's a little difficult. You have a bird's eye view right now. My point exactly. You can't see. I can't walk. We'll never make it. Yeah, you two suck. We'll make it, no matter what. You don't understand. Thought I was getting better, but I was hurt again way too easily. 
I'm a liability to the whole team. You're not. You're their leader. We can help them. We have to help them. Uh, April? I'm over here. <laughs> I think we're safe. Safe? Dude, we're trapped inside a giant hole! Um, did you feel something move a little? The fuck? I didn't know what's gonna happen. You guys okay down there? We're cool. What the fuck is this acid that they're in? Hot tub time! Nigga. All right. Not alright! That water's boiling at around 200 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, you're in an active volcano? Some sort in a hot spring? Yeah, guys are okay. That's why the walls are so smooth. What were the odds we'd be kidnapped by a giant mutant? Have you met us? What are the odds we wouldn't be kidnapped by a giant mutant? You As usual, Raphael is the smartest one. Me? You're the scientist. Let's make a giant balloon. Let's hit that Casey Jones. <laughs> <laughs> April. Donnie would Snap love out. this. Donnie would love it because Donnie's an idiot. April! Donnie's a smart idiot. <laughs> I am so embarrassed right now. It's okay. Just, uh, please stop trying to bite me. We have to hurry. So we can in the bar. Trying to so bite people to death. Mm -hmm. Oh man. I can't believe it. I'm standing. Nigga, won't standing. you stop doing extra shit? He'll figure it out one day. Let's save the guy. Take the cane with you. Oh, oh, old classic Batman style, y'all. They should not be on it at the same time. They shouldn't. It's gonna be too, too, too much weight, probably. Hey, y'all, what's going on? All right? Did you miss me? Oh God! Why? <laughs> I don't see how rubbing it on that is going to make it better. One hundred at a time! I see clouds. I'm flying through them. Faster and faster! Do you see the hole? Yeah, over here! Guys! Guys! Do you hear me? Are you alright? Leo! Leo! Yes! We're okay! But we're running out of time! I'm right on top of us! God damn it. Oh boy. She said, I'm not going to let this man get away. Wish you could I'm use her powers to intercept its thoughts. Why would you want to do that in the middle of the air, though? Oh, I guess that works. What about you? No worries. I'm getting the hang of this. I just need to hit myself right between the eyes. <laughs> Dude, it has gills. That's disgusting. Hey. Goddamn House of Dragon. Oh, wow. I forgot it could do that. Yeah, fuck with its gills, man. Yeah. That was some good eating right there, dude. It was. No! Woo! Leo, I remembered something. Casey and Donnie hit it on its head. It lost balance. Worth a try. Oh, it's okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. There you go. Ah! Woo! This is a wild ride. It is. Fucking Universal Studios. Hey. Now y'all can climb up the. <laughs> it blocked the hole. That's good, right? No, no it's that's right. bad. <laughs> the pressure from below has to escape somehow. If the geyser can't erupt, the whole mountain will explode. Guys, uh, move! <laughs> Thanks, Rick. April. Your eyes. They're still. Yeah, I can't see anything right now. The creature must be in total darkness. Um, guys, exploding mountain, remember? Oh, shit. 
Boy, this is some fucking Indiana Jones shit. Okay. What what the fuck is he gonna do? Yeah. April. Thanks. Thanks for what? I'd still be at the farm if not for you. You really inspired me. Oh, Leo. You guys were awesome! It's good to have you back, bro. It's good to be back. Yeah, I mean, if you're not leading, who am I supposed to complain about? Well, you complain about Mikey. That's what we usually complain about. All right. April? I I'm really sorry I tested that neurotransmitter on you. I'm not. Without that psychic link, we'd have lost you guys. Plus, it was cool to see through someone else's eyes for a change. Even if it was a giant mutant beast. But the link's broken now. The chimera's finally gone. Not. What? <laughs> Ain't nothing in this episode. I mean, in this season, died. It just goes away or it comes back or something. It's like, oh, you thought, bitch. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> you know, it's some shit like that. Oh, uh, but yeah, I don't know why I was expecting that to be the squirrel meme, but I think we had that already with the little. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Yeah. But that was a good episode. You know, I, I don't know why. It seems like I kind of tend to be like, I don't know, unimpressed by certain aspects of episodes where two characters that are usually capable are now crippled and they have to depend on each other because it's like a slow pace. You know, watching them struggle to get where they need to be and work off of each other. Mm -hmm. You know, it's the same thing with like, oh, you have two characters that hate each other, but they're stranded and they need each other, you know? So, yeah, I, I don't know. I think this is like the first episode I'm going to have to give up. Oh, me plus. Yeah, something about it. It's not that I didn't like it. It was good. Just, you know, it was good. It just was missing that that thing. It's like know? the seasoning was off, man. I'm giving it just a A. Just a A. Give it an A plus. It was still good. It just wasn't as worthy. Yeah, but we're gonna go ahead and keep it moving to the next episode, which is titled Vision Quest. Your favorite game. Alright. So let's do this. Did it got a pizza in it? No, it's the Hamato's uh symbol, remember? Some pizza. It's gotta wrap it. I almost destroyed the whole thing. You did. You didn't fuck up Leo's <laughs> knee. Why are you trying to hunt this beautiful animal? Oh man, what I do to you? I see what this is. This is a quest. Anytime an animal huh? starts glowing. <laughs> Don't run now! Oh god. <laughs> I can't be mad at this animal. It's like, what was you doing? Right. Damn. Why? Get him. Get him. God damn. Open season. All right. Shit. Elliot said, not today. Dude, what happened to you? I had a realization in the woods. Going off alone with a bum leg was a bad idea? No, it's just what I need. What we all need. We're so caught up in tea phones and junk food and TV that we become at odds with nature. A true ninja must become one with it. Uh -huh. himself. Hey, I like man, that. Leave TV out of this. <laughs> Even Master Splinter did it. He said only when you become one with nature can you make peace with yourself. Hey, peace? What are we, hippies? Okay, I'm all for <laughs> getting in tune with nature. But those two are going to be getting in tune with each other. Well, you have to learn to let it go. Oh, God. We need to leave our words and I cannot behind. stand you. <laughs> Casey just chasing her ass all around. We haven't achieved the very first of the 18 ninjutsu disciplines. The Seishin Suyu, or spiritual refinement. All true ninjas must master it. Hey, who says I'm not spiritually refined? Nigga. Whoa, must have been. Okay, you win. Yeah, uh huh. In the wilderness, about to kill the shit. My knee bent, but I'm about to finish it. Ralph on the damn tree, walk us in. 
making fires because things are dire, but we require, but we aspire. Oh, Mikey twerking on the beat. Working on the beat and we ain't in the streets. We up in the woods and everything's all good. Oh, yeah, training in the hood with the white eyes, no pupils. I, I'm a sensei and I'm not a pupil. Oh, they friends with squirrel now. You just squirrel trying to get a nut. Oh, wow. Damn. This motherfucker. Guys, look. Round two. Oh, shit. It was the same deer. I think it's been following us. That's yeah, probably laughing at the four dumb turtles lost in the woods. Actually, in the Shinto religion, deer are considered messengers of the divine. Ooh. Maybe the fuck? We're on the right path. Pan's Labyrinth? Mutant! No, wait! It's not a mutant! Hey. Get the fuck on, nigga. Why are they starting to beat up mutants? Mutants might be a good person. Right. Oh wow. Well, I've seen this scene before. Y'all think y'all slick. You're alive? Where are you, Sensei? Let us help you. You cannot yet. There is much you must overcome. If you cannot find your inner spiritual strength, you will not stand a chance against the Shredder. But Master Splinter, my leg injury, it, it's physical. Until I heal. We choose what holds us back and what moves us forward. You will all learn this. Each of you must journey out alone to face your spiritual adversary. That's right. Raphael, your temper is like a fire that you must learn to focus for power. Michelangelo, your mind is overrun with distractions. Learn to be strong. No, just gonna say, you are stupid. <laughs> Donatello, you rely too much on your mind and not on your body. Be strong like And you're a simp ass dude. Leonardo, you must be the leader in body and spirit. Be like the wind. Your greatest trial awaits on the spiritual plane. Mm -hmm. For the challenges you face there will be just as deadly as those you face in the real world. Be warned. <laughs> Master yeah. Splinter made our quest clear. It's time we begin, ninjas. Each of us will forge uh -oh. the armor and weapons Iron Leo. On alone, where we'll be challenged in the spirit realm, the place where the unreal becomes real, and we meet our ultimate fate. Let's go. Ooh. Uh oh. Okay. Ronin warriors. Why do you look like he got on a case of ass? He do. Hey, I'm loving it. I'm digging it. I like Mikey's little pose. I like this. I do too, man. You must be like the green hornet. Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> <gasps> hey, I got the train. Oh, wow. You talking to me? Wait! <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Oh, shit. We on the stage of Crash Bandicoot 1. What the fuck is she doing, my nigga? What are you doing? You're gonna have to fight this damn deer on the bridge. That deer still looks really cool. He do. Was it real? Well, do what Splinter said, man. Use his advice. Okay, not cool. Definitely not cool. Somebody's gotta be here keeping those torches lit. Who do you think, motherfucker? It's like cold under here. I mean, what the fuck? Having an illuminescence meeting? For all I know, this isn't even the right direction. Mm -hmm. Oh, I really miss GPS guidance right now. <laughs> what the? <laughs> You're gonna bring the whole mountain down! <laughs> 
you hear what happens? Because you're an apparition from the spirit plane. There you go. You might as well say that deer ain't number the guardian spirit of the forest. Even no. less. I was wrong about the camera. <laughs> I can do this all day. Okay, um, Steve Dodgers. No, 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 no. You gotta do better, man. <laughs> you gotta do better. Man. <laughs> Not as tough as I thought. Bro, I wonder what if they all in the woods just laying on the ground just tripping balls. Uh, 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 right? Because they ate the wrong plants while they was trying to get their damn meditation on. They even ate a Peruvian mushroom or some shit. Ooh, nice. You did that? Never mind. You need to hit that Street Fighter move with that Zangief. Oh, wow. Long time. Oh, friend. Way more into this spirit quest if I know I get to slap some butter on. Ooh. Man, see what I tell you, he ain't never Tony Stark. They know what they did with this shit. I can do this all day. Now he's shooting flames, the hammer and shit. I knew it was gonna be him. This nigga. Fish face? Here? That temper fizzles fast underwater, doesn't it? <laughs> Fine with me. That's right. <laughs> hey, the Seishi Studio is way easier than I thought. You get down with the sickness. Oh shit. We're just getting started. Let's see how quick your thinking is. I didn't sign up for this Frosty Flights commercial. For the rocks. Tiger Claw? No, you're just a spirit too. You can't be real. <laughs> I know they saw Frosty Flakes up here. Does that feel real to you? Damn. Absolutely. He's not looking at him what is your lesson? with a happy face. Lesson. Uh oh. You've already failed. Shredder! You were too weak to stand without your master. Yeah! <laughs> the they stand at all. Ooh! <laughs> yeah, ain't no pausing, B. Yeah. Shit, I Hell yeah. Don't he got a jetpack now? And he's a kid. Oh, come on, man. Okay, Mikey. What did Master Splinter say? Be still and calm like the forest. There you go. <laughs> Need to focus. There you go, yeah. I concentrate. I can beat him. Focus. Focus. Focus, 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 focus. Mm -hmm. Let's go. <laughs> I gotta stand my ground. You Get got to. Right? And they say you're the smart one? I'm twice your size. I can't get a very picture of fat rise splinter now. I forget they have the same voice. Strong, yeah. Like the mountain. <laughs> ah, yes! <laughs> I call that the FU. Fuck the F5. Focus my hand. Why does it like arm fishnets remind me of a stripper outfit? I do. It's supposed to be like a ninja thing though. Ready for Ooh. I bet your toys don't work so well under Nigga, water. I'm gonna have some sushi. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, filet. <gasps> filet a bitch. Ha! Eat it. Hey. Shit. Fake Shredder is beating the hell out of him. He beating him up the mountain. He okay? still hits like the real deal, man. Shredder's right. My injury is always gonna hold me back. I can't win. 
Do I need to whoop your ass? I got Christmas presents to deliver, but I can always give an ass whooping. Unless the pain is just in my mind. It's just an excuse. It's not real. That's definitely real. Ooh, he's gonna turn into Take a giant a boss. Hey, the fuck? It is time we end this. I agree. <laughs> God of War style, baby. Quick time event and all. Hey. I'm in the eye. Hell yeah. Very good. Very good. Very good indeed, man. I beat you on the spirit plane and one day, I'll beat you in the real world. I'm ready. <laughs> Independence Day. What happened out there? It's time. We gotta go back. We're going back to New York. Let's no! go. I know, no! man. No! I'm, I love the scenery so much. I know. It's been such a great change from what the hell we had to look at. It's Camp Chaos, but I love it. I'm I sorry. Know. I was but, really enjoying them out there yeah. with the villain of the day, not having to deal with the stupid Krang. For real, man. But that was an episode eight vision quest, which I see now. It's like in the name. Like I just love like in it, it like in a way this whole season seems like it's like been a, a extended training session of them yeah. just getting to understand their flaws and trying to better themselves in those weak areas. So it's good that they did that, you know. For all y'all that have seen the old school 90s movie, y'all know that that um, little projection of Master Splinter talking to them while they were meditating is basically, you know, homage to that. Which I kind of, I'm kind of getting mad at this. I like this, but I'm like, I want to show her the old the 90s movie, but it's like, it's going to be so familiar by the time she watch it because this whole fucking season was like a reference to that. And I'm like, that's why the fucking movie is so good. Because it made every, all the turtles what they are now you know what i'm saying raps the hothead up in there even though he's like a, he has an attitude and he's rude but in a cartoon but until the movies came out it's like yeah all of them were very unique in their own way and they just made them cooler well and that's what the this show it seems like the spiritual successor to those 90s movies but yeah, um, really enjoyed this one. I enjoyed this one too. You know, they had to get their mind right. Because if your mind ain't right, you ain't going to be right, okay? They had to get it all together. And that yeah. ain't, they had eight episodes, eight beautiful, wonderful episodes to get it together. And they got it. They went all back home to old, wonderful New York. Wonderful New York. Yeah, it's like they, um, hopefully they be more seasoned now that they going back, you know, they seem to have got their the head straight, you know, hopefully they got everything straight with all the shit that they fucked up in those woods because they caused more damage than anything along the way, but hey, it is what it all is. Right, they're probably not going to get it all fixed up. It's just going to be there roaming around. Right, at least it can't harm any humans unless they come visit. But yeah, I'll get that episode in S. I really enjoyed that. Yeah, like just seeing those characters, even though like we knew that there were illusions, it still felt like the stakes were high. Especially with um fake imaginary shredder. <laughs> so he was just getting all in Leo's ass. <laughs> just whooping him up and down the down mountain and shit. Like I really liked that. Mm -hmm. Cause I think that all those characters, like I say, all those villains that they were fighting represents their fear and that's something that they haven't been able to overcome because every time they came across those other characters it's like they had like a sense of fear especially when the shredders around it's like oh no what are we gonna do you know we're like we're outmatched so yeah but um you said you gave them this mm -hmm. 
Yeah, but that's going to do it for us today, guys. We hope you enjoyed this because we had a blast reacting to it with you and for you. If there's anything that we may have missed or gotten misconstrued, by all means, provide it in the comment section below without spoiling us on stuff that's going to happen later on in this season and the next season after that. But this is your boy RBG, a.k.a. The Random Black Gamer, my lovely wife, generally on the ones and twos. We ain't seen the reactions. We'll catch you guys on the next reaction to TMNT 2012. Peace.